Hello guys, Johnny here. Gonna be doing another little comparison video. I hear it a lot in the black powder shooting world that a 44 caliber black powder gun uh, revolver is about the same power as a 38 special modern well I'm just going to see how they compare. This is my carry gun, what I normally carry. Yes, I know the sight on it's broke. It costs so much to get a back sight for this rear sight. So I just learned to compensate. This is a Rossi 357 Magnum. I got it loaded with um, 38 Special. 158 grain flat nose bullets and I'm 10 yards away I'm going to shoot the left milk jug with it and then I'll shoot the right with my Ruger this is one for the lactose intolerant I dead centered it <laughs> Realize the Ruger has a 7.5 inch barrel versus the 4 inch barrel on my Rossi. So that could make some difference, but I'm using what I got. I don't have a longer barrel 357 or a 38. And I got it loaded this time with something a little different. My actual favorite black powder substitute. Alliant Black MZ and uh, the load is 40 grains of Alliant Black MZ and a 220 grain Cato Conical. Now what I like about Alliant Black MZ is it's almost like smokeless powder. It packs a wallop almost as powerful as triple seven it's non corrosive I let my old gun go three weeks without cleaning it just to test and uh, I had no problems with rust and you get a nice cloud of smoke if you was shooting a black you know real black powder and to me it smells the best. It kind of smells like a black and mild cigar. Now I got the CCI caps on it again. I might get a misfire. This gun was designed for Remington number 10. But I just haven't had the time or the money to go to Bass Pro to get anything. This is one for the lactose intolerant. <laughs> I hit a little high, but I think the Ruger won this. Let's go check it out. Okay, first we got a 38 Special. I dead centered it. And that's the exit hole, and it did split it some. Okay. This is the Kato 220, backed by 40 grains of Elliott Black MZ. It completely, that's the entrance, and it just... Then that's what it done out the rear, at the back side. I'm telling you, a Kato bullet, backed by good powder, like Elliott Black MZ, or... Alliant, I keep saying Alliant, Alliant, is a very, very devastating, powerful gun. Well, hope you enjoyed that little comparison. This is uh, Johnny the Shotgun Kitty, over and out.